All right, we'll go ahead and get started. Uh, I'm Mr. White. I'm head of the band, jazz band at the high school. Me and Mr. Morales, we teach the jazz band. And Mr. Cisneros here teaches at the middle school. The group you have before you is the 7th and 8th grade middle school jazz band. So go ahead and give them an applause. I must say, this is probably one of the biggest jazz bands I've ever seen, which is a really good thing for us, because that means hopefully they'll be coming up to the high school in a year or two, and we'll be able to put them to work up there. So, Mr. Cisneros, thank you for getting so many kids. Thank you, parents, also, for allowing your students to be in the jazz band. I mean, at the middle school level, it's kind of a new elective. It kind of goes on and off, whether they get one or two electives. But this year, they were able to get the second elective, so it's really helped out. At this time, I know they just dim the lights, but if there's any board members, administrators, or principals in the audience, can you please stand up so you can be recognized? <laughs> so we thank you all for coming out. Uh, we thank our fine arts director, Mr. Juan Nanez, as well, uh, and all the support we get from the administration, the board, and the community. So at this time, I'm going to go ahead and turn it over to Mr. Cisneros. Good evening, everyone. Um, once again, thank you very much for being here. Uh, not only are you supporting all these students, but you're also supporting music education and jazz education. So thank you very much, especially if these, this, these students is one of your children. Thank you for allowing them to be in the program. Okay, without any further ado, we'll get started with our first song. Um, it's a Disney classic. It's from one of the original Pixar movies, and it's uh, You Got a Friend in Me.
Thank you very much. That featured Carla Casillas on the trumpet in the back. Our next piece is another classic, um, recently made popular by a commercial with Tony Bennett and Lady Gaga. Okay, and that's big, it's cold outside. And we have Daniela Guerrero on um, alto sax playing a solo for us. So here's Baby, it's cold outside. Thank you again. That featured Daniela Guerrero on Alto Sax. Thank you, Daniela. And so, a real quick story on the monstrosity of the band that you see before you, um, at, in a good way, okay? Um, originally, they weren't going to be able to take two electives, so a lot of the kids weren't going to be able to take jazz, so then I started saying, well, whoever can take jazz, please sign up, okay? And then they said they can take three electives, so then, boom. I got all these kids, but I told them right now, it's better to have too many or, you know, a big number than to not have enough. So um, it's been awesome, an awesome year with these kids, um, with these students. They're all super smart. They're awesome. They're funny. They make my day during the sixth period. And, and I love teaching them every single day, even though sometimes I need a good kick in the rear to get going. So, <laughs> But they're awesome. Okay. Um, our next song, we're going to slow it down even more, and it's uh, the first in a while, and this features, right, Larissa Rivera on the alto sax. Yeah. 
featured Clarissa Rivera on the Out of Sight. Thank you, Clarissa. <laughs> okay. um, our next song is uh, another uh, well, kind of like a, a jazz waltz, okay, a little bit quack, quacker, quicker, sorry. Um, <laughs> thank you. Um, and this will feature Daniela Guerrero yet again on uh, the auto sex. She's a, a solo hog. She she was like, I want a mom. I'm like, Daniela, you have to share, it's Christmas. Okay. <laughs> so she was like, okay, fine, I'll let her have I'll let her have two. Like, okay, thank you. <laughs> All right, we three swing. Thank you. 
us. Thank you. Once again, that featured Daniela Guerrero on Alpha Sax. Thank you, Daniela. Okay, before, uh, before we play our final piece, um, I'd like to thank, uh, of course, you all again for being here. Thank you very much for supporting us. I'd like to thank all the other band directors um, and music teachers in the school district. And um, I'd like to thank uh, the administrators at, at Dorio Middle School, uh, Mr. Limon and with the rest of his gang. They not only create a, a wonderful work environment, but a great place for these students to learn. So thank you very much to the administrators at Dorio Middle School. And um, thank you to all you guys. You guys are awesome. So just really quick introductions. Um, saxophones, we have Amara, uh, the very sax. Um, tenor, we have Kendra and Yadira. Um, also saxophone, we have Daniela, Clarissa, Evely, Jackie, and Oriana. Okay, trombones, we have Jimena, Roman, Yosua, Naomi, uh, Ashley. Not, you're not Tokayo, you're Mr. B's Tokayo, Chewy. Yeah. Um, and Angelo, trumpets, we have Diana, Vanessa, uh, Carlo, Angel, Juan, flutes, we have Lizzie, we have uh, Nina, Paige, Valeria, Fernandez, we have Marco, Isela, Emma, Tubas, we have Juan, Juan, and not Juan. Just kidding, Juan, Juan, and Leo. Guitars, we have Eliana, Caitlin, uh, Espa. On um, piano, we have Megan, Andrea, Larissa, Isis, a bunch of piano players. Uh, percussion, we have Jared, Adelan, and on bass, my personal favorite. Just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> Isaac. So thank you all. Thank you guys. You guys are awesome. You make me love my job every single day. Thank you very much. Okay. And for our last piece, uh, it's a song that's uh, a theme song that's popular on, on television. And I won't give it away, but you guys should pick up on it. Okay, so thank you very much again. Here's our last song. Sorry, I forgot about the solos. Uh, the first solo we have is from Angel Reyes on trumpet. Like their angel. Yeah. And Clarissa Rivera on also sax once again. Okay. Thank you very much. Here it goes. Thank <laughs> you. 
Parents, we have here. Eighth graders. You have awesome children. This means so much to them. They may not tell you. They may tell you, don't go to my concert. There is no concert. But four years from now, they are going to love each and every moment. Deberían de estar orgullosos de sus hijos porque están haciendo una música tan linda. Están haciendo unas memorias tan bonitas. Este. If you want to do what we do, which is be around the kids and help out and do things like this, I want you to look at the trumpet player and the saxophone player and these decorations. This was done by her husband, Doug Herzog. The decorations were put up by my wife. When we bring our kids somewhere, we want to show them that we're ready for them and we back them up in everything we do. It might not seem like much to have a couple of Esperitas up here and some cutouts and a tree, but it means a lot to your kids. So, next year, join the band boosters. Linda and I won't be here. As a matter of fact, do you have a child in tonight's concert? No, she's in San Antonio. I don't have a child in tonight's concert, but somebody has to be here for the kids. Why am I saying that? Because I want your money. <laughs> Who brought money? What? I'm not kidding. All of this costs money. On Friday, we're doing a party for hopefully 120, 150 kids. Brisket, rice, seeds. We try to reward our kids for all the work they put in. And we do that a pickle at a time and a chili bag at a time. There's only 40 chili bags. Please buy them. Buy pickles. Buy pokes. If you're not thirsty, save it. Bring it tomorrow. Please. So, we have water too. So, join the booster program. It's a lot of fun. It's a very nice way to be around your children. And they can't tell you no because you're not there for them anyway. You're there for other kids. Por favor, apoyen a sus niños. Esos cuatro años que van a venir salen van volados. Para ellos es muy bonito saber que tienen el apoyo de ustedes, aunque no se los hagan saber. Sí es importante. Como anfitriones, mira que los niños vendiendo compran. Como anfitriones apoyamos al programa. Todos los fondos que recaudamos es para volver a meterlo al programa y darle recompensa a los niños, ya sea con fiestas, con comida, con cenas, con premios. So once again, please keep supporting your kids. It's very important. Sigan apoyando a sus hijos. How much was it to get into the country? ¿Cuánto costó entrar con cierto? It's the cheapest thing you're going to have all year. Va a ser la cena y la noche fuera más barata de todo el año. Por favor, apoyenos. Thank you. Merry Christmas. God bless you. Have a happy New Year. Thank you. 
Well, good evening. My name is Mr. Morales, and I'm the director of Jazz Institute at the Rio High School. And we will be, our first song will be a Big Band Christmas, and those will feature Annalisa Rio song too. I hope you enjoy our performance. It also features Diego Coronado. Thank you. 
featured musically in it. She also has a solo in it. So, and it's a fun song, Hunk by Jake Jarvis. I hope you like Hunk. Thank <laughs> you. 
changes and some high stuff on the trombones and has some really really difficult stuff so hope you guys like tangerine and yeah so this is, this is our last piece uh, I want to mention that uh, Oscar Guerra has a solo in this song and yeah, I believe this that's it as you are raised, I'll start from there. I think I'm going to do it. Thank <laughs> you. 
American Control, uh, a jazz arrangement by Glenn Miller. Originally released as a March 1956, along with it being famous during World War II, this arrangement of the iconic Frank Newcomb tune opens with a short written on saxophone solo before launching into a satisfying series of sax and brass solos, unison, unison, and full ensemble solos. American Control. So, a little add note to this. One of the reasons I picked this song, this is one of Glenn Miller's favorite songs during the World War II era, and it coincides with yesterday being Pearl Harbor Day. So, here's American Patrol by Glenn Miller. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm a junior and I play trumpet. Um, this song I'm going to be playing for you guys is called Watermelon Man. It's a jazz standard written by Kirby Hancock. First released on his debut album, Taken Off, which was in 1962. A tune that hit the top 100 pop charts, that is when multiple different artists were making different types of versions of that song. Hancock decided to change the song a bit and make it a fun feel. And the Watermelon Man became the top chart hits in the 1970s. So this song has a solo featuring Miles de la Gaza on Alto Saxon. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
by Judy Garland in the 1944, 1944 MGM musical, Meet Me in St. Louis. In later years, Frank Sinatra recorded a version with modified lyrics. In 2007, Have Yourself a Merry Little Christmas was the third most performed Christmas song during the preceding five years that had been written. In 2004, it finished at number 76 in AFI's 100 Years, 100 Songs rankings of the top tunes in American cinema. The song was later covered by singer Sam Smith in 2014. The piece we will play will feature Miranda Martinez on vocals.
Here, actually. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, on behalf of myself and Jen, and we thank you for supporting us, for those of you supporting us this year, for those of you supporting us before, we thank you. You guys are what make us what we are today. So we thank you. Round of applause for yourself. Thank you. All right. Now, let's say about this next song. Stephen Hardaway Morris was born on May 13, 1950 as Stephen Hardaway Judkins, but he's better known by his stage name Stevie Wonder. Stevie is an American musician, singer, songwriter, record producer, and multi-instrumentalist. A child prodigy, he became one of the most creative and loved musical performers of the late 20th century. Tonight, we are going to be playing one of his favorite songs that he's written out called Higher Ground. Higher Ground is a funk song written by Stevie Wonder, which first appeared on his 1973 album, Inversions. The song reached number four, on the Billboard Hot 100 and number one on the U.S. Hot R&B Singles Chart. Wonder wrote and recorded the song in a three-hour burst of creativity in May 1973. Oh, it was an awful. Okay, but uh, like I said, thank you guys again. And uh, there's one thing I'd like to say uh, from personally. I'd like to thank uh, my mom and my dad because without them, I wouldn't be where I am today, and I really love them doing today. Thank you. 
Bom, eu sou uma pessoa que está no Brasil. Eu vou para o 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 Brasil. We thank you for coming out and keeping jazz alive and doing real. I know it's not one of the most popular music, but it's one of the most creative. And we'd like to thank Mandy over here for doing our vocal chart with us. Uh, if you're used to our jazz band, you notice we're one saxophone short tonight. Usually Kaylee plays with us. But this weekend we had region band auditions in San Antonio and her and two other students made what we call All Region Orchestra, which is the first time ever. So not only no students, we went to 73. So they had a rehearsal in San Antonio tonight, so that's a round of applause for them. They did something like that. So again, on behalf of the Fine Arts Department, Mr. Juan Mendez, we thank you for coming out tonight. Uh, if I can have all of the high school jazz band students, we do need to pack everything up tonight. So please come up here and help us out. But thank you, everybody, and have a good evening.